my dog Walden has cancer. Walden, how you feeling, bud? Poor Walden, he's going to the vet today because he has a growth on his back leg. And so fingers crossed that it, he, it's nothing and that you're okay. Right, buddy? Right, buddy? Oh, what a sweet boy. Yeah. My mom took him to the vet today and when she came home, I, I just like knew that it wasn't good news. He has had a tumor on his leg that has grown to the size of a golf ball within the last four months. And before my mom took him to the vet, she took him outside and as he went to the bathroom and then he was like scratching to cover up his dog's do, he yelped and he wouldn't put any weight on that foot and he actually broke a portion of his bone when he was scratching today. That's why he yelped and he has cancer. So the golf ball size tumor is very hard. Usually tumors are, are fatty and squishy, but it is rock solid and it has actually eaten away at his bone. So his leg bone right at the joint, not a lot left. It's, it's mostly gone because of the cancer. So we are going to have him x-rayed and see if the cancer has spread to his lungs. If it hasn't spread to his lungs, then we will have his, his back leg amputated and he's been getting around, he's been limping for a while actually, and today obviously he wasn't putting any weight on his foot after he broke it. Anyway, I knew when, when he had such a big tumor after such short amount of time that it was, it was probably cancer. I mean, both of our other animals had tumors that ended up killing them. So I knew that it wasn't good and I, I kind of have prepared myself for it. Obviously we love him a lot and it, it's really sad, so... I feel like I, I'm kind of, I'm not even in shock, I'm kind of in like mother mode of like, okay, like let me take care of my mom, let me take care of Walden, like what do we have to do, like we were giving him pain pills and I was like, alright, what do, what do we need? Anyway, we'll see, hopefully he will just be a really cute three-legged dog and the cancer hasn't spread, but fingers crossed that Walden will be okay. Alright, so tonight Walden is going to get a full body x-ray to make sure that the cancer has not spread. Obviously if it has, he we won't amputate his leg, we won't do, do anything, and hopefully it hasn't spread. It, it's a very aggressive form, so if it has spread, that's really not good. If it hasn't spread, he'll get blood work tonight and then he will be scheduled for surgery next week, which will be a leg amputation at the hip. Walden's hanging out with me while I'm working today. Hi buddy, how are you doing sweetie? Yeah, you my little bunny today. What a good boy, what a good boy. Yeah, he's getting his x-ray tonight. Oh, poor sweetie. So update on Walden, got back from the vet and unfortunately the cancer has spread to his chest so we won't be amputating his leg since the cancer's already in other parts of his body, which I, I really thought that it wouldn't be and that we could just amputate his leg and that he'd be fine. So kind of out of the blue to receive a terminal diagnosis so quickly, just in the past like 24 hours, it went from everything being fine. He was just limping a little bit, but he hadn't broken his leg yet to him breaking his leg yesterday. And then us going in and finding out that he had cancer and his his bone has been eaten away by cancer so i think i'm definitely still in shock yeah pretty upsetting so at this point all we can do is just try to make him comfortable obviously he's in a lot of pain because of his broken leg but well, i mean he's still happy aurora <laughs> she just slapped me in the face with her tail so my mom said he walked almost the entire driveway today she kept trying to get him to like turn around and go back and he didn't want to so obviously he's still really happy but i think the pain will start to get worse and worse feel really bad for him because no one wants to have a broken leg and cancer so yeah that's the update unfortunately all right so <clears throat> walden had a seizure today he went in to get groomed because he doesn't let us brush him and he gets matted over time he was starting to yelp when we picked him up pretty much every time and, and like even around his abdomen and so we were afraid that his hair was starting to mount, which was making him uncomfortable. So we took him to the groomers and he did well at the groomers, but on the way home, he started throwing up, my mom said. And when she got him home, he was, looked like he couldn't move. So pretty much we think that he had a seizure and he was almost like unresponsive. Like it didn't seem like he could move at all. And he had just thrown up a bunch of times. So we kind of brought him in and just kind of made him comfortable. He was like drooling everywhere because it just seemed like he couldn't control anything. 
He rested for a bit and then he feels and sounds and acts a lot better now actually. He got really excited when I had lunch, but he also kind of acts like he his balance is really off and he can't move very well. He tried to like come after my food and he just like went in a circle. Yeah, I don't know. I kind of felt like this weekend be the weekend and it sounds like it might be the case. Okay, Aurora, this is not your moment, but we'll see. I mean, it's there. Our vet isn't open right now. So even if we wanted to take him in, we couldn't. We'll just see if we can make it through the weekend. So that is the update. We're just trying to make him comfortable at this point. I was reading a little bit of one of the books that I have to read. Good to great to him. And he seemed to enjoy that. He actually came and sat on my lap and that was like very new he never does that and that was his first walking moment which is pretty cool so that made me feel good but i hope that he enjoyed me reading to him he's out here hanging with our bud we brought his little bed out so he'll be comfy and cozy next to the fire he always really likes fires so we're doing a fire for him. Holden, are you a cute little man? Yes, you are. Oh, are you warm in Sierra's coat? Good baby. Beware of very scary puppy. <laughs> Beware of dog. <laughs> what a good boy. Come here. There you go. Come on. Go ahead, bud. Up. Action shot. <laughs> Come on, Weldon! <laughs> this little jump. <laughs> yeah, he's a little look over the shoulder. Yeah. Go pee, Walden. Go pee. You got it, buddy. Come on. You have to go pee. We're not leaving till you pee. Go pee, Walden. Walden, go pee. Go pee. Oh my god. Go pee, buddy. Walden, that's not your food, bud. That's not your food. You already had dinner. <laughs> so naughty. So naughty, yeah. Silly boy. Well then, did you get what you wanted? You gonna lick the plate? <laughs> so silly. So silly. He's so happy though. So happy. <laughs> Do you wanna go for a ride? <gasps> Do you wanna go for a ride? Look at that tail, look at that tail, yes. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, where are we going? Look at how cute the little puppy is. Hi, Walden. Okay. <laughs> Very anticlimactic. Are you tired? Is it a tiring day? Come on, Walden. Walden, yay! Come here, buddy. Oh, you're so cute. Walden, go ahead, go get daddy. There he goes. There he goes. <laughs> Walden, how did you get a leaf on top of you, buddy? How did you do? How did you do that? Yeah, you're specially talented, aren't you? You have special talents. How did you do that? What was that? That was on your back. Yes, you silly boy. <laughs> Mess Sarah up again. Go get money. Go get money. Go get her. <laughs> what a cutie boy. Hi, Walden. Hey. Do you have a little cape that you drug all the way from your bed? Yeah. Oh, what a sweet little baby. What a sweet little baby. Oh, he lost it. Hey. You did it. There you go. Is he happy? Yeah. Oh, good boy. You want a treat? Is that a treat? Ooh. Okay, sit. Sit. Stay. I should have him port facing you. Stay. Oh, okay. Stay. Stay. Release. <laughs> good boy. Good, good boy. boy. What a yeah. good boy. Good boy. <laughs> Mommy, stop touching me. You're embarrassing me. There we go. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> Hi Walden, are you just carrying around your blanket with you? <laughs> You're pretty cute. It's an on the go. Oh, oh, now we're just going in a circle. <laughs> Alright buddy, I don't have anything for Poor you to eat. Be be clear. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, but you did, and that's all that matters. <laughs> why, are we, why are we walking under Sierra? <laughs> Seems like a very bad idea. Is daddy here? 
You guys are so cute over there. <laughs> Give it to me. Are you eating any of that bread or are you giving it all to Walden? <laughs> it takes one bite. No wonder Walden's begging so much over there. He's got dab. Now oh, that looks cool, doesn't it, Walden? Doesn't it? <laughs>